Well, what we're looking at is the January data, because there's a bit of a lag effect here, Melissa. But when you look at the on-time ratings uh, in January, what we're looking at is an industry that generally it's up in that 78, 79 percent. And the industry leader seems to be every month, partially because of the weather that they encounter. Hawaiian, number one. Spirit, you got to tip your hat to them. They have improved their performance dramatically over the last year, year and a half. And then you have Delta in it, just over 82 percent, who were least on time in January. The bottom three, Allegiant, United, and JetBlue. As you take a look at the airline index, remember, we are starting to enter into this period of uh, airline pre-announcements, if you will, guidance in terms of the first quarter and what they're expecting. And so far, the focus is going to be on whether or not things are softening up a bit in the first quarter. Two airlines that will get a lot of attention, in particular over the next couple of weeks, Southwest and American. And I say that they're going to get attention because, remember, along with United, they have the 737 MAX airplanes that have been grounded. We'll be watching to see just how much of an impact that grounding has in terms of hurting the, uh, or not really hurting, but uh, limiting the revenue potential that they were expecting for the first quarter. So that's what the airlines did in January and also what we're going to be focused on over the next couple of weeks.